All right, everyone, wanted to give you guys an update of what I'm doing to put on weight. Um, I can't seem to gain a fucking pound. I just get leaner and bigger, uh, which is fantastic, mostly because I'm so natural. Um, so here's what I got going on here. This over here is where I spend most of my time. It's kind of where I work from. Um, it's like my fat ass desk, pretty much. Um, I eat over there. I sit over there. I use a computer over there. I got a little TV thing I hook up and like watch videos on while I'm on the computer and stuff. And um, I got this little fridge over here now so that I can get to food and stuff even easier. I'm going to start putting my food in there, but that's kind of besides the point. So here's what I'm doing. Kitchen's dirty. I got Snickers. I'm going to keep this on my table at all times. Just eat them throughout the day whenever I want them. Um, I got cheese. This is the cheapest cheese I can find. I got uh, some kind of roast. Pretty cheap. $4 a pound. Sandwich bags, plates, milk, peanut butter, mayonnaise. Okay, so here's my plan. I'm going to cook this up nice and pink inside in the oven. I'm going to slice it up real thin for roast beef. It's going to be the cheapest roast beef I can find. I'm going to cut this up in like a third inch slices, maybe a half inch slices. And um, I'm going to make really thick cheese sandwiches and also going to make really thick roast beef sandwiches. I'm also going to take this, I'm going to make really, really big um, peanut butter sandwiches. So I'm going to have three different kinds of sandwiches to choose from. Um, I love all these things. I love cheese sandwiches. I love roast beef sandwiches. I love peanut butter sandwiches. What I'm going to do is I'm going to make them ahead of time. I'm going to make, say... I got two loaves of bread here. I'm going to make two loaves of bread worth of sandwiches at a time. So say 20 something sandwiches at a time. And I'm going to keep them in my refrigerator over there. So they're always right next to me. I'm also going to keep a gallon of milk over there. And um, whenever I eat a sandwich, I'm going to drink. Now what I got going on is because I'm going to make the sandwiches ahead of time, I don't want them to get soggy. So I'm not going to put mayonnaise and stuff on them. What I'm going to do is, is I'm going to take this horseradish and mix it into this container of mayonnaise. And I'm going to put it in this. So whenever I'm ready to eat my sandwiches, I can just put it on right away. Um, the other thing I'm going to do is, because I, I drink whey, but I don't drink enough whey. What I'm going to do is, I went and I found these coffee cups at Walmart that have the lids. And I found these other cups at Walmart, these plastic clear ones, and the lids fit on them. Now they do have a hole right here, but if you cover it, it's a really good shaker cup. And what I'm going to do is, I'm going to have a scoop or two away in there with water. I'm going to make about 10 of them at a time as pre-made drinks. So whenever I pass my fridge... I'm going to drink 25, 50 grams of whey at a time. Um, so my plan is to have three different kinds of sandwiches, milk, and um, basically candy in front of me at all times. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to get an alarm clock. And every morning when I wake up, I'm going to press the alarm clock and set it. And then two hours, every two hours, it's going to go off. And every two hours, I'm going to eat some kind of sandwich, drink a certain amount of milk, and eat some of these. Um, I'm probably, if you guys ever watch Dumb and Dumber, you know, the most annoying sound in the world is like, Aah! or whatever. I'm going to get that sound. I'm going to have that go off whenever I'm supposed to eat every two hours. So it's going to be kind of hard to ignore. Um, I also love eating this food here, so it's going to be pretty easy for me. I love um, horseradish and mayo on with cheese sandwiches or roast beef sandwiches. And obviously, who doesn't love peanut butter and milk? So that's my plan. Um, this isn't going to be all I eat. Obviously, if I want to eat pizza or if I want to have something for dinner, if I want to have, you know, bacon and eggs for breakfast, I'm going to do that. But my biggest problem with getting in enough food is not having food directly around me that tastes good enough that's the right kind of food. So basically, I'm going to be surrounded by food, constantly reminded of food. Very, very, very easy to do. Like, I, these cups here, I'm going to keep the lids and reuse the lids and rinse them off. But whenever this cup is done, I'm just going to throw it out. And, um... That way I won't have to worry about cleaning my shaker cups because a lot of times I won't make shakes because my shaker cups are dirty and I don't want to clean them or my blender is dirty. So that's going to make it a lot easier for me. Um, so that's pretty much it. This is how I'm going to intend to eat even more throughout the day. Um, I replaced uh, water with Gatorade. I've been buying the powder, just filling up the gallon jug here. And um, that's, that's pretty much it. Uh, I'm not sure how much this is going to help me put on weight, but I imagine it's going to be pretty fucking successful. So um, I guess you guys will see how well it works over the next few weeks. Um, if you guys have any videos, ideas, or uh, any questions, or are looking for online personal training or coaching or whatever with uh, diet or strength training or whatever it is, um, hit me up on um, Skype or um, message me on here. Hit me up on Facebook or something. I'm going to put all my shit in the... Uh, down below or to the side or whatever it is now on YouTube. 
Alright guys, thanks for watching. Just an update for y'all.